In this session, we are going to talk about Google Talk to Books. Now, in order to open Google Talk to Books, just go to Google, and here you write Talk to Books, and just open Talk to Books. And here you are. Here it is, Google Talk to Books. Now, how can we use this wonderful resource to develop our literature or for literature writing? Now, what it does is, you do not need traditional searching in here. What you do is you use your natural language. And the more you play with it, the more you can get results. For instance, let's say I've got some queries here. And let's ask Google Talk to Books through these queries. These are different queries which include what, why, how, when, again another what and is. So you can ask different questions using different terminologies and it will give you an answer. So it will save you a lot of time. So let's say if I copy this first one and paste it here and see it can give me different definitions of the concept a definition of servant leadership is the practice of leadership that places the good of those led over the self-interest of the leader with an emphasis on developing a reciprocation of followers as leaders and uh, leaders and leaders as followers or i can say what are different leadership Theories. So, so uh, shared leadership theory, there are several major categories of leadership theory. So what you can do is you can view in the book. So you can view the text within the book as well. Let's say I want to view in the book. And here it is in the book. So let's put it like let's do another one here. Let's say I'm interested in why a particular concept leads to another another concept why servant leadership leads towards employee development so just put it in here and press enter so these are the possible answers that you get and these can further help you develop your literature review in a more critical manner and then obviously you can contrast different opinions like opinion of this author with this author or opinion of this author with this author so it can help you build a more critical literature review or let's say if you're looking for a mechanism how corporate social responsibility affects employees so let's say let's put it in here now corporate social responsibility represents the direct efforts by a company to improve, improve aspects of society by the firm as compared with the integral responsibilities that every firm has with respect to the primary stakeholders such as employees, customers, investors and suppliers. So there might be other argument in there. You can go and look into the book. Now there are other ideas as well. Look which you can find and which, which you think is appropriate for your study. Or let's say I want to know when did we like when did corporate social responsibility corporate um, concept actually emerge so let's search okay the concept of corporate social responsibility began to evolve during the 1960s so you can obviously get an idea when a concept actually evolved or let's say you want to know the dimensions of a particular concept so let's put it in here so here are the dimensions of servant leadership as per literature. And let's put another query. You want to know the differences between social responsibility and sustainability. Let's put it in here and see it is sometimes used synonymously to social responsibility, but there could be differences which you can obviously look for in other passages. So this is a great tool to develop your literature review and develop a critical literature review. Search for definitions and things um, that you that you can think of. Just play with it. And you can obviously 
uh, search particular areas or filter books by categories i hope this video would have helped you understand the use of talk to books play with it thank you